this lineup is crazy. I am so excited to eat this. Guys, welcome back as we review this week's Crumble Cookies. I am so excited about this lineup. Are you excited? Yeah, I am. I actually really, really am because there's a new one that I'm really excited to try. And one of my all-time favorites, this raspberry mm. cheesecake, that's one of my favorites. Mm. Actually, there's a, quite a few that I think are like some of my favorites. The Snickers is, this chocolate cake yes. has been before. We've had it before where I didn't really like it, but then there's times where we've had it, it's been really good. So. Look, this, this lineup has like the cookie, if you ask me. When you start combining like, like this Snickers, and we've had it before, when they do it right, and we'll find out if they did it right here, is definitely a top five cookie of all time for me with Crumble. And it's just a nice combination here. Like, they do a really good job of introducing a new cookie pretty much every week, I think. Like, they, they made it a goal. Too, yeah. And this new one this week, this, this brownie, brookie, cookie dough one, just, I mean, it, it looks really good. But we know sometimes the pictures can be a little deceiving and it doesn't always turn out that way so i'm interested to see the texture of that one but all in all like this lineup when i when i saw it i got i got excited like my heart rate elevated <laughs> quite a bit because oh of this okay and she gets me pumped up she's like wait till you see this lineup and i'm like <laughs> okay you're right this one looks insane so let's walk through them let's see what we have okay. so let's start you go ahead and show okay. it this is a double chocolate chip now this is the best of both worlds, a warm cookie studded with pieces of milk chocolate and semi-sweet chocolate, all topped with a dash of sea salt. Next up, we've got the new cookie of the week. This is the Brookie Dough Pie, a brownie pie cookie filled with cookies and cream, packed cookie dough mousse and topped with brownie cookie pieces and cookie <laughs> dough bits. Wow, I'm gonna eat that's that a one. lot. Next one up, we've got the Raspberry Cheesecake, a buttery graham cracker cookie topped with smooth vanilla cheesecake frosting and a dollop of raspberry topping in there as well. That one looks good. <laughs> that one's now this one, they just call it the Peanut Butter Featuring Snickers. A peanut butter cookie studded with chopped Snickers topped with caramel buttercream, a sprinkle of delicious Snickers pieces and a smooth milk chocolate drizzle. Like, if you're a peanut butter person, come on. I mean, that's that's about as good as it gets. Chocolate cake, a rich chocolate cookie topped with smooth chocolate fudge frosting and shaved chocolate curls. It's those shaved chocolate curls that do it for me. <laughs> I'm going to eat them and all. And finally, last but not least, the brown sugar cinnamon mm. featuring Pop-Tarts. So for all you Pop-Tarts lovers out there, uh, a warm brown sugar cinnamon stuffed cookie topped with a brown sugar cream cheese glaze and crumbled Pop-Tarts on top. So this lineup, I'm going to go ahead and say here, my favorite, I'm going to anticipate, is going to be the Snickers one. Like hands down, I love Snickers, I love peanut butter, I've had the cookie before, I'm just going to take the cake. I think my least favorite on here is going to be the Pop-Tarts one. I don't know. It just looks a little underwhelming to me. It looks a little dry. I just I, that's that's what I'm gonna say. What about you? I'm gonna say my number one is gonna be the raspberry cheesecake, and my number last one, sixth one, is gonna be the chocolate chip. Chocolate just because it's just one. whatever, but it does have sea salt on it, so it looks does look good. If you get a bite with that sea salt, it can make all mm. the difference. So I will say this: just looking at them here, this chocolate one, the chocolate one with the shaved pieces on top. Like I'll show it again one more time. Like this one is appealing, very appealing from a visual standpoint. Like look at that. They did that one up right. Yeah. And you eat with your eyes first. So that one could be, I don't know. That one could definitely be up there. So let's go ahead and dive in. My dear, okay. you do, I the, do the honors. Cutting. Palette cleanse to start. We didn't, we didn't cheers. <sighs> mm. Okay. I'm going to start with my... We always I'm go least thinking favorite. My least favorite. So it's the chocolate double chocolate chip. Here you go. Double chocolate chip. So it looks like they have the regular chocolate chip cookie plus the mm, semi sweet. The semi sweet. Right? Uh huh. All right. Let's see. It tastes like their chocolate chip cookie, which is really good. 
is a really good chocolate chip mm -hmm. cookie. This one's a little thicker. I'm trying to yeah. get in there and see a little bit, but yeah. you got some chunks in there. Look at that. I like the thickness of that one. It's not warmed up. Like, look, if you just want to have a cookie with some milk, that's, that's one the cookie. Of, yeah. I think my next least favorite is going to be maybe this Pop-Tart one, so I'll go to that one next. I feel like this one could be the dark horse, though, that comes out on top. I don't top. know. I'm just not seeing it. Okay. Well, I'm going to try it. She always takes her bites, like two bites for her little piece. I'm just a one and done. That one is good. It tastes like a, a maple um, donut almost. What do you think? Do you think it tastes like a maple donut? No. <laughs> I think it tastes what I expected. It's good. It's a cookie. Surprised. Um, I thought one was really good. I don't think it's really good. It's mm, it's. I, I much prefer the chocolate chip over that. It's good. It's all right. Just not a whole <coughs> lot going on there. Okay. It is a little dry. I like that one a lot. Palette <laughs> Now we are going on to the chocolate cake. Is Ooh, that what it was? Chocolate that, cake? That frosting looks okay. absurd. Yeah, it does. How do they make these truffle pieces on top? Mmm. Diving in. Mmm. The, mm. the little chocolate pieces make it have a little texture. That is good. Like a crunch, which is really good. That is really good. The base of that cookie, it's like a little brownie-ish. It tastes like their galaxy brownie. It one. does. It's good though. But the um, the frosting mm -hmm. on top is so good. Mm -hmm. Frosting on top is smooth good. chocolate fudge frosting. Mm. Um, it's fudgy. It's good. Yeah, the base of that one is good and chewy. Slightly better than expected, even. And I that expected it good. to be pretty good. That's my front runner so far. All right, I'm gonna go to the Brookie one. Um, I'm gonna go to the raspberry cheesecake. However, I do think that this one's gonna be number one. But I feel like we're having so much chocolate. Yeah, let's break it up. Let's go. That's a good call. Yeah. I can do a little raspberry. Okay, in my let's mouth. do a little raspberry. This one's thick. It is Thicker thick. It is thick. Look at that guy. It's like somebody got a little lazy in the back of crumble and just didn't want to quite flatten, flatten it out. out. All right. I'm going to spread my raspberry a little more. Mmm. Mmm. Oh my goodness. Not raspberry jelly. That raspberry is, woo! Mmm! That is so good. It reminds me of the Trader Joe's raspberry jam. Oh my it's goodness. It's like the best jam. Guys. And that, ooh, that graham cracker crust too. That is. It that comes is in late Everything. Too. That jelly is unreal. Mm. Man. That's gonna be a hard to beat. Man, that is gonna be hard to beat. That, that's. That is good. That's really good. That is good. so good. They that's nailed what, that raspberry jelly. You never know with that jelly. Like you should you get like that synthetic, just like I think of like the Smucker's jelly yeah, or whatever. That like, one has like, like no, that's yeah. like seedy, mm -hmm. like jam almost. That mm -hmm. is really good. All right, I'm gonna go to Brookie Pie. Make sure I get a little I bit know, of this the one cookie looks dough. A little soft here. I know, and the cookie dough looks a little like As we're wilty. Cutting it, that cookie dough looks a little looks, a little sad. I feel like it has the potential to be really good, like the flavors, but I also feel like they might not have nailed it. Might not be as sturdy as it needs to be, but let's see. The cookie dough just like dissolved in my mm -hmm. mouth. Which I didn't want. <laughs> Yeah, it's okay. It kind of tastes like a it's chocolate okay. cream pie. A little bit. A chocolate cream pie with like some cookie dough little pieces on top, but they don't taste much. Like it all yeah. kind of tastes the same. Yeah, these cookie dough pizza pieces are just. Uh, Almost I was feel wanting like a little more firm, like a little more. If it would have been a little more firm, maybe if they were chilled. 
Maybe we should have chilled them. Yeah, we probably should have. I mean, it wasn't like warm, but. I know, but. Yeah, maybe that one. If you do that one, I would recommend doing it chilled. It's okay. I don't get like. I thought a, it was good. I didn't think it was bad. No, it's not bad. It, I don't know. You, you have a new cookie and you kind of want it to be like just this amazing cookie. It was it was good, but no nowhere near the raspberry cheesecake or the chocolate. Okay, one. I do think that this this uh, Snickers one might take take number one. I just have always liked that raspberry one a lot. So, but I, this one I haven't had for a while. I feel like they haven't had this one on the yeah, menu like for a really long time. Minute. So. I made him put extra Snickers on here too. Yep, we stopped them. We stopped mm. them and said, you know what? Hit Need it up. More. We gotta put some more peanuts, some more clusters on there. Okay. Mmm. Okay. Mmm. 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 Mm. That has okay. Look at this. This has like a little peanut. Let me try to get. Yeah, it's like peanut there in there. There is a there. peanut in there, like a whole peanut. Mm, that is. If you like peanut Ooh. butter, you like peanuts. You, you like, like Snickers. That's the one. It's the frosting on there that is that is so, so good. That is. I just got to clean this little piece up here. <laughs> mm. Okay. They do that right. Mm -hmm. I feel like they're ones like this Brookie Pie. Is like one of the ones where it's like that's new and stuff, and then they perfect it. Like as the like if they do it again, they might do it a little but, different. I feel like the Snickers maybe the first time it came out wasn't that like perfect. Perfect. I don't know. That's such a unique frosting on there. So it's like mm -hmm. a peanut butter frosting. The way they describe it, um, let's see, a caramel butter buttercream cream. is what it is, and it's like it's so unique. It's not just like your typical sugar frosting or like a cream cheese frosting. That is really good. And then they've got this chocolate drizzle on top that's like firmed up a little mm -hmm. bit. So if you look at that, you see that chocolate drizzle is kind of firmed up on top there. That just adds like a wonderful texture to it. So I'm ready to give my ranking. Okay. My favorite, drum roll please, is going to go to... Wow. I did not think that that was going to happen, to mm, be honest. That masterpiece. I didn't think it was going to happen either, but that cookie, okay. the graham cracker okay. base and all wow. that is just, it's, it's, it's unbeatable. That's my number one. My number two actually goes to the chocolate fudge one. Number three is the Snickers. Number four is the chocolate chip. Number five is the Brookie. And my last place one is the Pop-Tart. The last place one? That's, that's my, my ranking. My top one is these two. Okay, agree to disagree on that. Those well, are we my... agree on, on the, but which one's better? I don't Let's know. One. Really? If I had to Come eat a on. whole cookie right now, it would probably be this one, because yeah, it's not You can so... have it, I'll take the other <laughs> one. I'll take the other one. Okay, so that's your. That's my number like one. One and two, okay. And then I would say number three for sure. That's like Snickers. almost number one too. And then I would say chocolate cake. And then Brookie, and then the cook. I just feel like you could make that chocolate chip. So I mean, if you like, were ordering a four pack, yeah. okay, what two would you leave out? These two. Brookie and chocolate chip cookie yep. you'd leave out. If I was ordering a four pack, I would leave out Brookie and... The Pop-Tart? Pop no! Maybe, maybe. The, <laughs> yeah, the chocolate chip cookie, I like... I thought it was you, so good. You know what to expect, and it's pretty much like always on the menu. I, it's, I don't know. The Pop-Tart was good. Don't just, hate on the Pop-Tart. Just a little flat and dry. It's good. For me, that's all. It's but, good. You know, solve, solve it all. Just get a six pack. There you go. And then figure out what you want to do from there. There you go. So that is this week's Crumble in Review. We'll see you guys next week with uh, next week's lineup. We're looking forward to it. Let's go. Mm -hmm.